Okay, I might end this. We shall see. We will find out soon enough. How cute is this mug? My roommate made it for me. Made it for me. Just like because I was on uh, a trip and last time when I came back from my trip I was like really sad. I didn't want to come home. But this time I was like, thank God I'm back in New York. So she made me this mug and it's got Bianca on it. How sweet. All right, we are actually filming the most special vlog this week. Um, it's been a whirlwind to get here. A whirlwind? But officially, welcome to my I'm getting a puppy vlog. Nah! <laughs> it has been such a long story. Getting this puppy is like impossible because they're super rare, but it's this, this breed that I've wanted literally since I was 10. Um, and they have just like never left my mind and then back in december i spontaneously ran into somebody in new york with that puppy and i was like is that a quaker hanji and she was like how the fuck do you know that <laughs> i'm getting my own quaker hanji they're super difficult to get uh your hands on in the states so i had actually originally um been in communication with a breeder in italy um who i would have been able to pick up my puppy from in about a month but then looking at flights like i cannot transport the dog back um they have to be like at least four months old for like major airlines for international travel so should have probably known that before better i did it so i panicked and then quickly started reaching out to breeders here in the states and i met someone who like basically had a puppy ready to go this week um so yeah flying down to Florida in two days to get my baby puppy. And in order to do all that, today is my day to prepare everything. I'm gonna get the bed. I obviously don't have that much time and everything. They have a crate for me down there that I can use. Um, I need to get some toys, pee pads, all that good stuff. So welcome to my journey of getting a puppy. All right, y'all, I'm finally prepared to head out. For anybody that's wondering, this is my puppy preparing outfit. Um, I'm gonna first head to a bougie pet shop. I remember going there thinking, okay, the minute I get a dog, I'm gonna go there. So, first heading there, get like the, just a couple of things that I want, like nice, and then I'll go to a regular pet shop to get like the bed and all the other essential toys and stuff like that. So, yeah, let's go. Day. Tomorrow's officially my pickup date and I'm flying to Florida at 7 a.m. I ran around like four different stores yesterday and the se selections were not great. I ended up ordering some stuff from Amazon as well, so mostly have everything here now. Pico, can we do this in silence? First things first, I got these bowls. They had no options. Like, this is way too big, and I actually wanted something that would like hold them into place, but they do have like rubber, so it should hopefully stay in place. Um, and this is the cutest one that they had. I like it. Picasso. Next up, toys. Uh, they didn't have that many options either, so I got this little rabbit. I have like no idea what uh, he's gonna like or want. So um, we'll kind of have to play by ear and see. But I got this little rabbit, uh, and then I got a couple of squeaky tennis balls. Um, I got these chew toys. They're like flavored, flavored chew toys. So we're starting off with those three, and then we'll kind of see what my baby will want, and we'll take it from there. I was really excited to buy this uh, little uh, poop bag um, and then I have like just a bunch of additional poop bags for the future. I got some little snacks for training. I obviously also got like food which I'm not going to show because it's not that interesting. Um, pee pads 
for now while he's still in training. And then I got this cute little harness. Still a puppy, so this is about the size I think I'm hoping will be right. Uh, yeah, it's blue, it's very cute. I'm happy with it, it just arrived from Amazon. Cool. And then lastly, I got this little bed. Uh, again, not my first choice, but uh, they didn't have that many options, uh, and neither did Amazon, or at least not something that would arrive in time, so this is kind of what I settled for, but it's not bad, it's cute, it's just not as soft and plush as I would have wanted it to be, but this will do for now, it matches my room aesthetic, <laughs> so... Alright, that's basically it, uh, I was serious about food wet and dry food and I'm getting a crate from the people there uh, they said they'll give me the one that they have so yeah not bad I'm really excited tomorrow's the big day good morning it is 4 36 I'm about to get changed and go to the airport I've never gone to the airport with like just a tote bag before so this is a first for me as well. Something I've wanted since I was a baby. Alright, we are at the airport bringing Finn to his little tea station. Uh, first time for me to utilize this room myself. But yeah. We have successfully entered back into the airport in Tampa. Um, I've got my new baby right here. It was so heartbreaking to have to only pick one, but I'm very happy. And yeah, we're going to let Finn have a little pee session and then go back home to New York. Hi Finn! Are you nervous? Are you a little scared? I know, I'm sorry. Yeah. Hi Finn! What do you think of your first airport experience? Do you like it?
YouTube debut. Hi. All right. So it's been a whole week since I've gotten Mr. Fluffy Face, and he has been nothing but a sweet angel. Yeah, it's been a whole week, which is crazy. It's probably the happiest I've ever been in my life. This is Finn. Finn is a total angel. Uh, so naturally good natured. Good, naturally good natured. He's so good natured. <laughs> Even without training, like he's just like naturally a really good, nice, kind dog, and everything I ever wanted. So. Uh, adjusting to puppy life, um, he's now somewhat potty trained on the pa pee pad. Nay, baby. I wasn't prepared for him to grow so fast. Like it's only been a week, and he's like much bigger already, which is crazy. Camera roll is completely full with puppy content, some of which I will plug in here. Maybe super, super duper happy. He's been, like I said, such an angel, such an angel. Hey. So he's not fully vaxxed yet, so I'm not allowed to walk him outside, but I've been like carrying him and going on a walk myself, just so that he can kind of get used to the world around him, but he's been really good, like he doesn't freak out from like car noises too much, motorcycles are a little scary for him, but like uh, police car, police sirens, like everything seems to be super fine. Um, He's just honestly been the sweetest angel. <laughs> so, life is good. I'm gonna end the vlog here. It's probably a really short video, but I just wanted to document my experience of getting uh, Finley. So I'll have this in my records forever and I can always look back on his sweet little pupper face. Thanks for watching.